The year was 1803. Napoleon had expanded the French Empire greatly. Many nations were revolting against their current rulers, and the American population was exploding. They wanted to expand west, but there was just one thing containing them. The territory of Louisiana covered the entire Mississippi River Valley. It also covered the Midwest and stretched to the Rockies. The U.S. understandably wanted this land, as it was full of natural resources. They heard that Napoleon could no longer sustain his wars, and they offered to buy the, la the land off of France. He accepted, as the French barely had enough military force to hold all the land they occupied. The U.S. paid $15 million to France. This added 825,000 square miles of land and 60,000 new citizens to their country. On April 30th, in 1803, the territory of Louisiana was handed over to the Amer American officials from the French officials in New Orleans. As the Americans began to um, go west, many more of them began to feel that it was their divine right to control the territory from Atlantic to Pacific Ocean. This feeling was referred to by historians as Manifest Destiny. After the Louisiana Purchase, much changed, but much also stayed the same. For example, the sense of Manifest Destiny was used to convince Americans to support the purchase of the territory of Louisiana. And it was also their justification for fighting costly wars against Mexico during the westward expansion. Something else which continued after the purchase of the Louisiana Territory was the use of Manifest Destiny to justify the relocation of millions of indigenous people from their traditional lands to remote territories. Of course, an event of this size would also change many things. Pre the Louisiana Purchase, America was a relatively insignificant nation. But after they had nearly completed their expansion at west at the end of the 19th century, they were among the likes of Britain, France, Russia, and Spain in world power. Throughout the rest of the 19th century, American nationalism was rooted in a geographical and spiritual sense of what they share.